In this design example, we'll see how to calculate the seat pan length. Uh, so we are looking for the distance between the uh, buttock back and the popliteal uh, tendon. So number 14 in the Stephen Fissan book. Uh, you can check that uh, detailed definition for this buttock to popliteal length. Now, in this case, we are trying to, so here is the design restriction. If this length is too long, then uh, the shorter person uh, will not be able to sit comfortably because it will hit this muscle and it will make very, very uncomfortable, let's say in driving a car or something like that, um, in very quickly. So what um, we are looking at here is uh, we are going for the reach. So if the shorter person do not hit that muscle um, when they are sitting on this seat, uh, then the taller person will basically not hit that. So we are going for reach here. Now, this wording might be a little bit contradictory under these circumstances, but the word reach is basically for the smaller person can reach. Um, it came from that definition. You can check the Stephen Fissand book for details on these uh, three criteria. Uh, the body dimension in this case, we say, uh, buttock to uh, popliteal um, um, length. Uh, and then the user population is female because female length is uh, uh, length. I have already extracted this value here. So from the anthropometric table from the same book, Stephen Fison, I have a reference in the openeducator.com. That's the first reference. Um, it's a great book in the workstation design. Uh, I don't think there is anything compare or come close to that book. So that's a very uh, good book. Let me show you. Let's see if I can show that quickly. So under the openeducator.com, uh, this is the book I'm talking about. Uh, the first book on the, this is the Stephen Fisan book, textbook that I use for most of these videos. Um, so population percentile, let's go for fifth percentile population. So then I have converted all these dimensions and then um, simply this is the um, value, converted value uh, from that 50 percentile. And then clothing allowances, I don't necessarily think we need anything for that. So that would be zero in this case. So basically if you sum it's the 17 and a half inches uh, for that um, um, seat pan uh, length. Um, so this is how you calculate the seat pan length.